Hey, what's going on, y'all? This is another episode of Johnny Bobby's Junk Call and Roll Off Dumpsters. We got a big job over here. It's a hoarder cleanup. Well, these folks left the mess in here, but guess what? We're going to come get it. All right, we're going to do a walkthrough, show you what we're working with, and we're going to get on to it. So just give you an idea of what we do. We're going to get rid of all this stuff. Trash cans obviously will stay. This trash can got to go. We're going to pick up all of this. We're going to take this with us. All of this has to go. We're going to fill up a lot of dumpsters today. So we're going to put it all in here, there. We got some 40 yard dumpsters coming. And uh, all of this has to go. And we'll just walk around outside. And I guess I'll open the garage. Get this party started. All this has to go. Everything you see here has to go. All this. There's quite a, there's a bunch of junk in the attic, has to go. Refrigerators, white goods, all of this stuff has to go. Everything must go. All of this, she wants this cabinet out of here. We're gonna get that out of here. Oh, I got a little stuff. All of this stuff, gotta go. Everything there. Ooh. Weight room, the gym, snapper machine, the whole nine yards. It's a lot of junk here, people. Folks, they was actually living in here. They just left. They got put out. So as we go through here, I know it's a little dark. We'll get some lights here in a second. If I can find them. So, no, still no light. See if this light works. Oh, that light is shocking. There's a light. Everything must go. Couches. All this stuff. This ain't got no light bulbs either. Either way it go. All this stuff they left. Dog cages. Everything got to go. These folks was something else. That. Everything in here must go. All of this. Well, we got a hands full of them. That's pretty neat. I guess they smoked a lot of cigarettes or something. Cigars. Everything here. Gotta go. All of that stuff in there. Living room. Everything here got a pretty cool little setup. The big screen, I guess they didn't want that. It was too much for them to take with them, I guess. All of this got to go. Hopefully, get some light. It's not camera action. Oh, I got one little light. All of that. So, got my hands full. And uh, well, guess what? Ain't nothing to it but to do it. I'm gonna open this so I can get to it. Get some air in here. All of this junk, we went through this. Got a nice pool set up. Barbecue grill. Watch the pool. And we're back outside. So, all this junk. We gotta get out of here. All this. It's gonna get heavy. Pain in the butt. And that's it, folks. But well, we take care of all this stuff. Johnny Bobby's Junk Call and Roll Off Dumpsters. Also, Leftovers Junk Call and Waste Disposal in Louisiana. Same company, just two different places. But anyway, that's what we're going to do. We'll show you the before and the after, and we'll get out and let us know if you want us to these kind of jobs so we can take care, take care of you. The actual website is jbthinc.com or joelf.com. That'll get you there or leftoversdisposal.com. 757 563 4834. All right, have a great day. Okay, here we go in this attic, and there was another attic up here. And they had three tons of debris in this attic. And there's the other side. But we gotta get all this crap out of here as well. And this is a mess. I can't believe these folks had this much crap up here. But anyway, get this stuff knocked out. Get up out of this job. And we'll let y'all know how it ends. This episode of Johnny Bobby's Junk Call. We told you about this junk removal job they was working on. And we had all this stuff out here. 
and we had to get rid of every last bit of it. If y'all remember those wooden blocks was over here. It was all, that's all gone. That was a lot of work, a lot of tonnage. All that stuff that was in the yard is all gone. It was about 140 yards of debris that came out of here. That's 140 yards of debris and tons and tons and tons of stuff. If y'all remember, these trash cans was full of stuff. His backyard had all kind of stuff going on. He had that line of things around there. That's all gone as well. We cleaned this up, cleaned all the trash up, picked all the boards up. It was a tent and a tarp and all kind of crap back there as well. We cleaned this up. It was thousands of bricks back here. They're all gone. When you tell us come get it, we come get it. We didn't fool with this pool. We don't do pool work. They're going to have to call somebody else for that. But uh, remember, there was a bunch of stuff back here. The barbecue pit it was all gone. We swept it all up, made it look clean. And then if you remember this place here was a mess. We cleaned all this up. We, it was a big pile of trash and diapers and they decided to just stick everything right there. We picked all that up. That's not gone. It's all clean, as you can see. Uh, we're gonna go in the house. I guess we'll go this way. It's all gone. Now we are clean out service, not clean up service, but we do sweep up pretty good. We try to make people are happy with a job so they can do the least as possible on their end when they flip in or wherever the case is gonna wherever the case is gonna be. As you can see, the table's gone, all that's gone, the trash is gone, all the stuff off the walls is gone. This house is ready to do whatever they want to remodel. All this junk out of here is gone. As you remember that stuff, it's all gone. We had cleaned all this junk out of here. Took all the window treatments down. They wanted everything gone. This might not show that well on YouTube because it's kind of dark in here, but there's nothing here. Everything's out the closets. Everything is out of here. This thing was full of stuff, as we recall. It's all gone. Nothing in the closet. Got a little light right there. We're going to get rid of that here soon. Just need a little light to see what's going on. Took everything out of the closet. Cleaned the bathroom up and out. As you remember, this room was full of crap. Like a lot of stuff. Closets, all gone. All this stuff is gone as well. It's all gone. I don't think we'd be like, we like trash, man. We ain't missing nothing. Bathroom is, all this crap is going out of here. So that's gone. The kitchen, as you saw was gone. All the cabinets has been emptied out. We're going to grab those black bags. We're going to put that person's passport in the mail. There's nothing in the cabinets. As you can see, this is the other side of interest to that room. We're going to back out of here just so you can see what's going on. And the monster attic in the garage and all this stuff is gone. And this nasty bathroom. We took everything out of these, this thing was full of stuff. We took it all out, all the sides, everything is gone. The bottom was the same way. And then we had the bathroom, it was terrible. Got rid of that stuff. Now, where I did mess up on this job, is I we took all the shelving down, is I messed up on that because I was, when I bid the house, I was too lazy to walk my ass up there. And it ended up being 2.3 tons of junk in this agate. I, I, don't even, I didn't even come up here. 2.3 tons of junk was up here. Metal, you name it. Uh, tried to move those boards. This house was so old, it kind of the house starts sagging a little bit, so I left them there. They didn't want no trouble. But all this junk is gone. Empty. 
Uh, I guess I'd put pictures and show how it did look, but uh, as you can see, it's all gone now. Terrible. Terrible that people live like that. I got to back out of here, so it's going to be a bad view for a while. And that pretty much sums it up. The whole house is cleaned up and cleaned out. If this lady got some complaints about this, I don't know what to tell her. But it's all gone bye-bye. And that uh, sums it up for Johnny Bobby's junk calling roll-off dumpsters, leftovers, junk calling waste disposal in Louisiana. You can catch us at this number right here. And that be all, folks.